Hi everyone! So today is going to be a special video um, requested by and dedicated to a YouTuber out there who goes out um, who goes by the name X282. Um, yeah, so she just wants to know how many glasses I have and um, if I could show you guys the pair of glasses that I have and stuff. Um, so I'll start first with um, how I got to wearing glasses. I basically had a retina detachment when I was about four or five. Um, yeah, my memory doesn't go back so far, but yeah, around four or five, I started wearing specs. It was basically um, after a really big operation, after my retina detachment, I had to wear really thick specs. As you guys can probably already like notice, my specs are pretty thick, like thicker than the average, and um, it's like I don't even really know my prescription, but I know it's like really high. Yeah, so there's like two different um, measurements of prescriptions, I believe. There's one that's like like a one and something else, or and another one which is like a thousand, like in the thousands. So if I'm looking at the thousands ones, it's definitely going to be like a thousand three or something, a thousand four. And um, my left eye is actually worse than my right eye. Although if you look at it this way, it's both really equally thick. Um, yeah, I'll get, let you guys have a look. Oh, you can't really see, but yeah, my glasses are really thick. Like that that's the actual thickness of it that you can see there um, and these glasses are really good because they actually sm um, sort of mask how thick my f my lens are if you look from the side so the only way you can actually tell is if I go like that and you can actually see like how thick my glasses really are so yeah I um, started wearing specs when I was really young and I've been wearing specs ever since I do occasionally wear contacts, but I have to wear the hard ones because they basically don't make soft lens in such a high prescription, or my eye is just not stable enough to handle soft prescription lenses, and um, I mean soft lens, and they're kind of uncomfortable for my eye because upon wearing contacts for more than about six hours my eye tends to get really red and you can see all the reddish veins along my eyes and people go why why are your eyes so red and it, it doesn't really hurt me but um when i take off my contacts for the day i actually feel the strain like i feel the strain like there's a like a relief um yeah, if it makes sense, there's relief. I, I feel relief in my eyes from straining for that long. So yeah, I don't really like to wear my contacts unless I'm really like going out for some occasion. Yeah, or stuff like that. And um, yeah, so these are a pa like a basic black pair that I got from. Um, I live in Australia, so the the shop's called Spec Savers, and they're supposedly like the cheaper, cheaper um, alternative to buying spectacles and whatnot. And um, yeah, how how good at I, am I at explaining things today? So yeah, um, I got these actually as a backup pair because last year I bought a pair of um, glasses from Prada and these are what they look like so they look pretty similar oh that look really weird but yeah they look really similar and oh gosh you can see how dirty that is but yeah um, they're really similar but this one's actually um, wider for me and this one's really very pretty narrow um, along the side of my face and this is actually broken, which is why I'm not wearing these, like this pair right now. This part, like how it goes in like that, this basically can't go in because I'm missing the screw or something over here and it's basically broken. So you can't actually screw it back because 
the thing's just totally broken off and um oh yeah so now you can see how thick my lenses are there and there so yeah um you can see you might be able to see that this one's a bit thicker than this side but yeah they're both really thick anyway for like um compared to ordinary lenses and um yeah i really like this pair well obviously who doesn't love Prada, I believe, so, yeah, but they broke, and they broke really fast, they broke, like, in a couple of months, I think I broke it in January, or February, maybe, like, January, I think, yeah, so, I've been using it for, like, half a year, and they broke, and that's really disappointing, so, yeah, um, that's that, and before the Prada pair, I had a really, really nice looking pair as well. And these were the ones that I used to have. And they are really nice. Like, if I wear them, they fit my face really well. I'll show it to you guys. So, yeah, these are really good as well. But unfortunately, um... Yeah, and it's like metallic red around the rim. And yeah, they're a really good shape for my face. Um, but they also broke on me. So something similar happened. Like this, um, this like leg or hand. I'm not sure what you call it. Um, yeah, but this like wing area thing actually broke on me as well so this part's fine but this part's really wonky and they just since they broke they obviously don't fit my face well and these are irreparable because the screw in here is very different from the normal ones and yeah they just couldn't repair it so that's like a total complete loss but I like to keep my old pair anyway um, yeah, but I really like those pair. They were really, really funky with the red rim and red metallic rim and whatnot. And um, because I have quite a, well, not very sharp face to put it nicely, um, I prefer to wear the glasses that are more um, long and square. When I was young, I had these pair of really, really, well, my my glasses were really thick when I was younger like even thicker than they are now and I used to wear those kind and it was just so so funny and I used to get a huge amount of ridicule because of my glasses and because of how thick they were and oh yeah by the way these are like as thin as they could go and I wear glass lens I don't wear the plastic ones um, so, yeah, I think plastic, they can actually make it thinner than the glass lens, but, yeah, and these are like the extra, extra, um, compressed kind of lens. So, yeah, like the normal highest is probably 1.7, I think the way they compress it, but mine's like 1.8, so that's really, really compressed. And, um, before my red glasses... Oh, by the way, the red glasses were Leona at Minston, so they make really nice pair, of, like they look really nice, and they have some really funky designs, and that's how the band looks like. It's really cute, and um, yeah, and before those, I had these ones, which are a bit more oval shaped than um, the current pairs that I have, but this one fits my face really well as well. So when I broke my Prada glasses, I was without um, glasses for a couple of weeks, in fact, because it takes like one month or so to make my glasses. And I had to wear these old ones, which um, the power is really off. But yeah, like as you can see, it's pretty wide as well over here. So it fits my face um, fairly well still, but the, it's just that the power is really off. And yeah, so as you can see, by changing my frames, I'm totally changing my look. So that's how much glasses frame your face. And it's important to find the right pair. So having said that, I wish you all good luck in finding the perfect pair for you. And 
I'll talk to you guys in the next one. See ya!